cruyff, branch. The Irish word cruyff referred originally to the bough of a tree, but like English branch, it can signify any, literal or figurative, offshoot from a central core. Irish cruyff is commonly used in genealogies to denote a particular branch of a family, and it can be combined with the word for scattering, squilu, to give cruyff squilu, a term which was used in the Middle Ages to denote the wide descent or dispersal of peoples. By the end of the 17th century, Kriv Skuilu was being used also to discuss the dissemination of information. Early examples appear mostly in religious contexts, and modern Irish Kriv Skuilu is still used with words meaning gospel and faith to signify spreading the gospel or propagating the faith. In media, Kriv Skuilu once meant broadcasting, but this has now been superseded by Kriulu, a relatively recent verb which originally meant announce. When applied to people, Kruiv has overwhelmingly positive connotations. It functions as a complementary term for both men and women in some of our earliest sources. St. Bridget is fondly identified as in Chroiv Gomlothev, of using terms for trees metaphorically to refer to a person. The implication, of course, is that the person possessed the qualities valued in the tree, such as the ability to offer shelter and support and to produce sustenance for life. A medieval word for what is often an ancient or venerated tree, bile, crops up in phrases such as bile bonava, meaning roughly the hero of Ireland. In the early 17th century, another alliterating phrase, dos dijan, tree of protection, was used in praise of Hugh O'Neill, Earl of Tyrone, who left Ireland for mainland Europe as part of the so-called Flight of the Earls. Why then is the All-Ireland Championship referred to in Irish today by the phrase Cruyff na Heren? In ancient Greece and Rome, winning athletes were presented with palm branches or wreaths of laurels to mark their victory. And from this we get the English phrase, don't rest on your laurels. That is, don't become complacent because of your past victories. In early Irish, palm Palm is used in a similar way, but the modern language relies on Cruyff na Heren, the branch of Ireland, to bring home the past victories of Greece and Rome.